So let's talk about how we can prepare. Well, one of the things I think is really important is we need to ask the right questions. So if someone comes to us and they say, that, you know, we're having a meeting with someone, they're, oh, this is our performance problem. Um, I really need my people to be able, be able, I'll do an example, I need my executive team to like each other and trust each other and work more effectively together. How would we do that? So some of us are very experienced. So the first question would be, what content do I already have that I can repurpose? Does anyone have a problem with that as a first question? Go ahead and put it right in that question panel if you do. So is my first question, what content do I already have that I can repurpose? Okay, and some people are saying, okay, <laughs> thank you, Amy. <laughs> okay, These are, there's some people that are way on the uh, way on the efficiency side. I do that right now. That was awesome. And then someone goes, that whole question is wrong. That is the dumbest question ever. Okay, so excellent. So here's what I'm saying. Sometimes we've written so many things that instead of really listening to people about what they need in terms of performance, we build what we have. So we basically put the, you know, the round peg in the, in the square hole or whatever, vice versa, versa, right? So I catch myself a lot of times saying, oh, I'm going to stop listening now because that sounds a lot like our half-day project management workshop, so I'm just going to tweak that for getting my team to work better together. No, you're not. That's insane. Okay, so I actually, you'll see, I don't think that is a good question. I think we have to, if we're really going to be ethical and do our job well, and I agree, someone says, no, that's a bad question, but it's usually what we do. And part of the reason we do it in our defense is we're busy, and we got a lot of stuff to do. So we try to find shortcuts and be efficient. Okay, so I don't think this is a good question, and I think we have to guard against it. Now, once we really know what they need, can we reuse objects? Of course. But we want to keep the outcome in mind. And so the questions, as you, many of you are saying in the question window right now, the question is instead then, what content do I already have that I can repurpose gets replaced by, what do you want them to be able to do at the end of the session that they can't do now? And a lot of times that's coming from the leadership who requested it. What do you want to describe for me? What they'll be able to do at the end of the session that they can't do now before we build it. Okay, and the second question I love, which is a tricky one, is why did you call me today? Yeah, what do they want? Or maybe what do they want to be able to do? Depends on who your sponsor is. But I also like the question, why did this become a problem today? Did suddenly everyone go crazy on your executive team? No, so what's happened is this has been building, but there was some event that triggered this hysterical call today, and you need to know that too because of the politics involved. Okay, so you have to be able to know both ends of it. One end is what is the performance need, and number two is what is the business and governance structure there that I have to operate in. 